Greetings, Daniel Perseto for Adobe Photoshop, and today we're going to look at Hide Mesh, Keep Shadows to get those really interesting effects. Now I have everything lit here fully and everything exposed on the canvas in the scene here to show you what all the objects are in the scene. Now I'm going to go ahead and turn off the infinite light because I don't need that anymore. I'm going to turn back on my point light, which is what I was using, and as you can see, wow, look at that. Now, I have the OBJ, this little ball here, selected, and that is one of the key elements to give you those shadows. Now, I'm going to select it here and pull it out of the scene here, and you can see that's what's creating those shadow effects. And I found this on the internet somewhere. I don't recall what site. But that object is selected. Now, I'm going to say, don't catch shadows for me, please, because I don't want shadows in the middle of the air. And here's the other one, check invisible. Now, this is in the properties when you select your object. Everything that you select in the 3D panel has a property, and in this case, I selected invisible. So now it's gone, and that's it. That is the trick. And I can just say render. In this case, I have these shadows a little bit softer, and you can change this effect very easily. I'm going to say escape to get out of the render. Select your point light, and I use a point light because it shoots light from every direction. And I can change that effect very easily by just pulling the light out of the object or putting it back in the hidden object and you get some really beautiful effects and if you play with the softness of shadows or, the, or you can make them actually quite sharp if you want if you do them quite sharp then it just gives you that kind of effect you might expect with a very sharp edge so that's the trick if you have any questions please leave them on the channel thank you for watching